Hi everyone, this is Carol from Lily Rose Blue, and I am here today with a quick video, and this is going to be hashtag 1K and celebrate 60, and this is on behalf of a inspiring person, honestly, so inspiring, um, inspiring, wonderful person who really cares about others, um, as witnessed either in her videos or just in what she does and what she has, the plan that she has to do with her life. And that is Trudy Craig. Trudy, you just, you really just, and uh, wow, 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 is, is all I can say. Now, Trudy is doing a wonderful, some giveaways for, um, to celebrate being close to, uh, or she may have already achieved it by now, um, 1,000 subscribers, as well as her 60th birthday is coming up. Now, her birthday is actually in December, but Trudy, being the wise person that she is, realized that, yeah, um, that's probably not the best time to be asking people to participate in a contest. And so she's doing it now. And I think that's wonderful. So what she asked us to do, um, there were many things. We She wants to rename her channel. So again, if you go to this, I wrote it on this scrap, hashtag 1K and celebrate 60, and it's Trudy Craig is her is her channel name right now. So she wants to rename her channel, and she tells you why she wants to and what the options are. Um, she talks about some ideas she has for some uh, you know, going back to school and to further help people, just all kinds of things. So one of the things was to decorate a library card in your style. So Trudy, I'm going to say that um, I am reorganizing <laughs> my craft room and I just wasn't putting my fingers on my library cards. I know I have some don't have a lot, but I have some. So instead, I had this stamp set and you can, and it's all about books. So here is a library card with lots of dates that this fictitious book was um, checked out. And it says between the pages of a book is a wonderful place to be. And, you know, two or three, I'm sorry, two or three, um, iconic stamps of books and it says we lose ourselves in books we find ourselves there too and then it has from the library of and then it's it's time to write the next chapter and oh my gosh um now that i read that yeah i may have to incorporate that into this card somehow because that's kind of where um, Trudy is going, honestly. So since I couldn't find my library cards, I used the stamp and I did spray some Dispress spray stain. Try to say that more than once. Oh my goodness. Um, it is a Tim Holtz Ranger product. The color here is Tumbled Glass. So I used that. So I stamped uh, first and I stamped with stays on ink because I knew I wanted to spray, you know, liquid onto that. And if you would use regular ink, there is a chance that um, it would not have worked. You know, the ink would have ran, that kind of thing. 
So, um, yeah, now that I, I wished I would have read that stamp, I'll, I'll think about something, uh, but with that. So I stamped, I sprayed, I used this Distress Ink Festive Berries because I really like, and actually I didn't even write this on the back of the card, um, that pink and turquoise or, you know, darker pink and turquoise color grouping and I like green with it. I think yellow is pretty with it as well and orange. But I chose to use these colors and I I also chose dictionary page just because I thought it kind of fit with the theme of a library card. So I I ink the edges of the card, I ink the edges of the dictionary page. Um put put the ticket on there. I did not ink that because I thought that might be a little much. And then I glued on this really fun button that I recently found these in, you know, through cleaning and reorganizing. So I did that. Um, am I 100,000% thrilled with this? No, but I think, I think it's okay. So, uh, Trudy, I will be sending this to you in the mail um, as an entry. I'd say the colors are my style. This is kind of my style. I Yeah, I don't know. And then in the video, too, it also gives you instructions for some information to put on the back. And, and I have done that as well, including a uh, life lesson or piece of advice, you know, for life. And boy, there are so many things that, you know, that you could say for that. Um, I will share that I wrote, let me stop and say something. And as Trudy approaches her 60th birthday, I have a feeling she might also be experience, experiencing this. Um, and actually, I hope people figured this out sooner than I did in my life. But, you know, you just don't have to put up with disrespect. Whether it's disrespect for you as a person, um, disrespect, like blatant disrespect for your views and opinions. You know, I just, as I get older, I just don't have much tolerance for that anymore. I think it's okay to have a different opinion. I just don't think it's right to be disrespectful of that different opinion um, for, for what it's worth. And you know, the more I look at this, I guess that's might be a little bit too big, but that would be kind of cute too. So while I'm talking, I will do that too. And I have one second. I have my some of my inks right here. I think that will work. So we'll see. Hopefully, you know, sometimes, sometimes, you know, you should leave well enough alone. Do I do that? <laughs> yes and no. <laughs> so this is a heart foam stamp that I got in my lovely Secret Santa package from Dolores Rush. Ah, uh, you can't really tell it. But I kind of like adding that, I kind of like adding that, yeah, little bit of that on the card too. So we'll do that, it's okay. 
I'll I'll work more with those foam stamp that foam stamp and see what I can do. Um yeah, I just don't think you have to put up with disrespect and it, it, I it's not if you've watched my channel before, you know that I am a supervisor as well and don't mess with my people. <laughs> when you're talking about disrespect, do not mess with my people. Um, it, it won't go well for you <laughs> if you do. <laughs> Again, I would be, I mean, part of my job is to follow up when things don't go well. Um, I will be respectful. I will listen to your side of the story. But I'm not just going to ignore what happened either. I'm, I'm not. I will no longer do that. And ignoring something that has happened to one of your staff members when you're a supervisor, I think that's wrong too. Um, so sorry, I'm getting super philosophical here, kind of getting off on a tangent. But that would be my, that would be my advice is just don't put up with disrespect. Just, you know, why? Why put up with disrespect? Um, you know, you just, it's, it's not good for any, anybody. It, it really isn't. So yeah, that's my advice. And sorry, I'm reaching, there it is. Sorry, sorry. I am reaching for this is just what's handy since I don't since I'm filming and my heart stamps are in a different spot I am coming back in here with a star stamp that I did have on my desk which is still a little hard to see but you kind of get the idea. You know, sometimes it's, you know, you get inspired. When you, you know, you just think of something randomly. So that's what I'm, that's what I'm doing here. Hopefully I haven't gone too far. There we go. It's, it's a little cray cray, but, <laughs> but it's okay. It's, it's okay. I still like it. Hopefully Trudy will like it. Um, yeah, please, please go to this hashtag, hashtag 1K and celebrate 60. Listen to Trudy's video. It is very inspiring. Um, she deserves all the support and love that we can send her way. And, you know, think about subscribing to her channel. Her giveaways for this contest are just out of this world. Uh, just fantastic. So with that, I am going to stop. And Trudy, I wish you success and love and happiness and happy birthday. Mwah! Take care. Bye-bye, everybody. Thank you for watching. Stay safe. Have some fun. You know, take care, of course, and think about what advice you would give somebody. Just random, you know, and what I said to you was just something that is um, present on my mind right now, just because last week was a rough week at work, both personal, I mean, both professionally for me and for some of my staff members. And um, so it's just on my mind and always and always and always God bless. Bye bye.